immediately next to Falcon 9 on your screen, uh, not the larger gray structure. Uh, it will uh, recline more fully as Falcon 9 over time to compensate for decreasing atmospheric pressure. And stage one locks load is closed out. Otherwise, the drone ship is on standby in the Atlantic Ocean. The payload is healthy and go for launch. The range is also go for launch. And at this point, we're inside of T minus three minutes and getting pretty close to T zero. Strong back lower is ended. Strong back's at 88.2 degrees. So let's listen in to the last couple minutes of terminal count. Tilted Falcon to begin a pitch kick maneuver to get it going sideways. You just heard that uh, we're going supersonic and we're about to go through max Q when the rocket's pushing hardest against the atmosphere. Vehicle is experiencing maximum dynamic uh, We're actually decreasing the thrust in our engines a little bit around the time of max Q to minimize some of those forces. Coming up about uh, 50 seconds from now. Head back into chill. Uh, there'll be three events in quick succession. The main engines will cut off, the two stages will separate, and the second stage will start its Merlin vacuum engine. Cutoff happening just a few seconds from now. Pico. vacuum nozzle. Uh, of course, at the very other end of that stage is the Bangamandu Satellite 1. Uh, right now, that Merlin vacuum engine is glowing. in the video signal, uh, we are looking at the 25th recovered first stage of a Falcon 9 vehicle. Uh, what a great sight. Uh, that is a camera on our drone ship. Of course, I still love you. Uh, the crowd's going nuts here at SpaceX headquarters in Hawthorne. Uh, while all that was happening, While all that was happening, uh, we did have a successful second stage engine cutoff of that uh, second stage carrying come on new satellite one. Uh, so uh, uh, while we're all very excited here at SpaceX to recover our 25th booster, uh, the primary mission is still to bring Bangabandhu Satellite 1 into geostationary transfer orbit. Uh, right now, everything's looking good from that second stage. Uh, it's going to coast for about 17 minutes or so. We're not going to be with you for all of that. We're actually going to just look at a simulation of where that second stage is. However, we will come back in approximately 9 or 10 minutes to guide you through the rest of the satellite deployment. <laughs> 